This is Serenity Caravan's video for this 2011 Eldis Crusader Super Sirocco that has just arrived directly from the previous owners. The video uh, we are making because it, as well as the photographs and editorial you may have already seen this just gives you a little bit more information um, and uh, a real sort of up close um, uh, view of the overall condition of the caravan. Uh, 26 feet long and one inch the uh, Super Sirocco 2011 was a very expensive caravan when it was new, built by the Explorer Group, uh, and their residual values are excellent to say the least. So we'll walk around it. Um, you'll notice they've got privacy glass on the windows. These are sights windows which are flush fitting. Adds to the sort of style and design of the uh, caravan, make it quite streamlined. Very distinctive back end with these distinctive back lights on the 2011 model, uh, with like a sort of graphite effect on them. Which are quite nice. Thirty fifth edition. Nose cone is uh, unmarked, uncracked. Uh, okay, so we'll put the camera up on the top so this will give you an idea of the condition of the roof and also the position of the skylights, etc. Uh, running on 13 pin electrics on the BPW chassis and it has the IDC control, the electronic stability control aid. Uh, you've got a wet locker on this side and the battery locker. You've got an external barbecue point on here. And moving to the interior. Here we go. So it's a four berth caravan. Uh, 2011 made some quite uh, significant changes to the uh, Super Sirocco's, they were modernised quite a bit. I'll uh, go into more detail about that in a moment. So you've got two long bench seats, this turns into a double bed if desired. A pull out table here, drops down and then you've got a further occasional table to go behind that. If you've got more than two people sat here eating. Uh, LED lights all the way round, a nice Pioneer music system with an iPod connector and a remote control is up there. I've just noticed the keys in there, I'm taking those out and put a label on them. There we go. Right. And there's your sort of aerial shot of the uh, interior. The band uh, 2011 model, it obviously has got all the central heating, wet central heating, onboard water tank with uh, monitor levels um, and a uh, uh, Oh, I can't remember the name of it now. The alarm system. Anyway, they're a better alarm system than some other caravans. It's such a well-known manufacturer, I can't even remember the name. So here's the uh, stainless steel sink with the smoke glass top. Put that across. Auto watch. That's the name of the alarm. There we go. Condition of that is very good. And again, 2011 new. Uh, 2010 would have had three gas burners. Uh, but the 2011 model will have three gas burners and the electric hot plate down here. Different oven again to the previous year. Lots of storage underneath here. For that area is cutlery and all sorts. And this is a handy cupboard. There we go. You can put tins and bits and bobs in there and it just slides out. Shut that up. And then the large Tetford fully automatic fridge freezer. Next there. So moving into the bedroom area, as you can see, you've got this sort of um, double bed, fixed double bed to the uh, set off to the uh, to the near side of the caravan. Uh, this lifts up. Whoops, hang on, that's a, there we go. This just lifts up and reveals this copious amounts of storage underneath, which is accessible from the um, outside as well for your awnings and chairs and bits and pieces. That's an Eldis's bed set or cushion set rather, bolster cushion set. Television will sit up there and then your 
this flap drops down and that gives you additional workspace in the kitchen. But otherwise you have it up and then with the uh, concertina door that comes across here this separates the bedroom from the rest of the caravan all the uh, all the heating as I mentioned the vents and radiators all around the caravan um, large wardrobes lots of storage in here overhead lockers as well and then moving into the bathroom which is sumptuous to say the least this is a Tepford C250 toilet Another wardrobe, that's the header tank for the Aldi heating. Yes, sumptuous because of the shower. And this, obviously, this uh, uh, door, whoops, Perspex door just comes across like so. There we go. Uh, overall condition inside is absolutely impeccable and uh, much the same can be said for the outside. Uh, it's obviously been very well cared for this caravan by its previous keeper. Um, as you can see, hopefully from the content of this video. Okay, so that completes Serenity's video for this 2011 Crusader Super Sirocco.